This is called Outstanding Balance, San Francisco, 2003. I do what I do best when I have no job and no money and no hope. I write a poem. I pay lots of money to institutions in order to do this. I have paid no money but have given up everything in order to do this. I've tried reasoning with the phone company, the credit card company, and my loan officers. I try to tell them I'll negotiate them through trade. I will write them a poem. A nice poem. I won't use bad words or say how they make me want to kill myself. I'll lie so well that my readers will like what they see, if only they could let me. But they speak to me in dollars and cents and dream about the things they will buy when I pay them. They talk to me in fragments and numbers and remind me that they possess lawyers and contracts and lots of other important people who are going to make me pay. They're not interested in my poem. And since everyone thinks they're a poet, they look at my offer like a sack of sewage on their front door. It stinks, they say, and it's taking up space. Just send the check in the mail, they persist. We just need a signature, they say. You can keep the poems. Just send us the signature. Then we can get this whole thing cleared up.